Hello and welcome to my Site Travel Pro review. In this Site Travel Pro review and Site Travel Pro demo, I'm going to be showing you inside the members area and showing you how Site Travel Pro works. I'm going to show you how to create a site. I'm actually going to be creating a site for you and I'm going to be showing you what it looks like. So, um, what is Site Travel Pro? Site Travel Pro is a cloud-based app. It's it's a cloud-based uh, app. You don't have to put anything on your computer. Um, it allow you to create a self-updating travel website in less than 60 seconds, and it's completely powered up by affiliate offers. So it has 700,000 plus hotels in it. It's got 4,000 airlines, 40,000 top places to visit, and 100,000 car parkings in just a click, just one click. And it's loaded with your affiliate offers. So you put in your affiliate IDs for those sites and then once somebody books a hotel or somebody books an airline or somebody books a, a car parking, you are going to get commission for it. And not only that, but there are other ways of monetizing this as well. There's an upgrade that will allow you to put Amazon products on there such as luggage or handbags or anything travel related there are there is also an upgrade that will allow you to uh, put in uh, a lead uh, so where you can put in a, an opt-in form and it's a pop-up where it allow you to put in an opt-in form and it will allow your visitors to put in their email address and you will collect your leads that way but those are completely optional so i'll go through all of that later but for now i want to take you inside site travel pro so this is Site Travel Pro inside the members area. And it looks like there's a lot going on here, but there really isn't. Um, it's really very simple, actually, because it does all the heavy lifting and hard work for you. So it's kind of looks similar to a WordPress dashboard over on the left-hand side. So all we need to do is to create a new site. We're going to go ahead and create a new site right now. And you would just need to, uh, this is under the dashboard here, and you just need to build a new site. Just click on this button that says build a new site. And it's given us three options. And these are amazing options it gives us here because it gives us the option to create a website just under the sitetravelpro.com domain, which is a subdomain under theirs. It gives us the option to put it in under our custom domain name, which is a domain that we would have bought elsewhere, such as Namecheap or GoDaddy, and will allow us to put it on another hosting provider. And here's an option for us to put it on WordPress. And um, it's really, really cool because all you would have to do is just download a plugin and a theme and connect them. And it's all on your WordPress website. So you can put those on your custom domain names, either custom domain name here, which would be uploading files to your web host or on WordPress as well. But for the sake of this uh, demo, we're gonna go ahead and click website name and we are going to name this let's see what can we name this um travelers so we'll name this travelers.sitetravelpro.com that's going to be our web address travelers.sitetravelpro.com then we're going to hit submit and it's created it has created that that quick so site travel travelers.sitetravelpro.com and let's go ahead and I'm going to open this in a new tab and I'm going to show you what it looks like. This is our new site. Really, really cool. And all of this stuff is customizable, by the way. I'll show you that here in just a second. So um, we get we get a beautiful looking website here and we get options. Let me scroll down a little bit so you can see it. We get options for social media on the left hand side. We get options for booking hotels. Now, like I said, once you put in your affiliate links in here, you are, if somebody clicks on this and they uh, book this, you're going to get an affiliate commission for that. Uh, it's got uh, travel places, places to visit, uh, flights. You can book flights straight from this website. And once again, if somebody books a flight from this website, you are going to get affiliate commission. So somebody clicks it, it takes it to another website, 
your affiliate your affiliate ID is attached to that. So up here we have a cool uh, web um, menu here. Uh, this will take us to our home. Uh, this is a hotel search, a flight search, a travel places, car parkings. We can get a weather report. We can get a blog. And if you purchase the optional upgrade with the Amazon store, you'll get a page up here in the top. It'll say store. That's not available to me. But um, if you do make that uh, optional upgrade, you'll get that, uh, that store right here. So going back to our Site Travel Pro um, main dashboard, we're going to go over to Website Settings. Now that we have created the website, we just need to tweak it up a little bit. So let's go ahead and find our website here, travelers.sitetravelpro.com. And we'll go click on the um, edit button. And here we choose our logo. I don't have a logo ready uh, just for the sake of time. I'm not going to upload our logo, but I just want you to see that it's here. So we're going to upload. We can upload our logo here. We can put our contact email. We can put a short description about our content. Um, here's where we put our Facebook profile, uh, Instagram, Twitter, opt in form to generate code to opt in form code to generate your leads. If you have, have the optional upgrade to do that your site title, site description, and website favicon. So I'll just, I will put this in. Traveler's site. Just to see that up here it will change. So we'll say website. Oh, we have to fill out something. Info at travelers site travelpro.com okay and then we'll refresh just so that you can see that it updated okay traveler site okay and that's where we do all of our website settings now we can manage pages here if we want to add pages to our site so we can do any type of page that you want affiliate disclosures just like this one is set up to it's not this is set up to a different site of course but um, these pages are set up so if you wanted to set up pages like this, you could do that. Affiliate settings, this is where we would put all of our affiliate IDs in here. Booking.com, Hotels.com. This is for our News API key. This is from NewsAPI.org. And the reason why we would want to put that in is because there's a blog section. And we can automatically pull blogs or articles from News API and stick into our uh, into our site so that it's constantly uploading fresh content and here's the option to disable the subscribe pop-up if we did go ahead and purchase that uh, blog campaign so we can do blog campaigns here so if we do if we could create a blog campaign let me click on that and show you that we, we can actually put in RSS feed URLs so you can go find RSS feeds from all over the internet if you want throw in here you can use the you use their database of RSS feeds now this is in an upgrade and I'll show you that here in just a second of all of these uh, RSS feeds to you that you can use for from them or um, you can search by keyword this is by using the newsapi.org and that is free newsapi.org is free to join if you haven't joined that already so if we go to manage articles over here on the left and we can create our own article just one by one and just click create your own article and as we as you can see you can choose the feature image you can put the body in here uh, and the title and select the website that we want we do travelers and some put in the title description and then your featured image and uh, let's see ad manager so we can put in banner ads if we want so we can add advertisements that little button up there will add advertisements and we will go to the website list and select travelers and advertisement positions we have all kind of positions and it gives us the exact sizes that we need to use and then uh, we can put in the script codes or the banner image and the banner target link so that in a nutshell is site travel pro let me go over the upsells for you very very quickly so the front end is um, 
just loaded with everything that you need. Um, unless you need more than 10 blogs, because this gives you 10 site licenses. Um, this will load you with the 700 plus hotels, 4,000 airlines, 40,000 places to visit, 100,000 car parkings. You can uh, put in the affiliate program. You can use banner ads or Google AdSense if you want. Um, this does the the, the plug-in. So uh, the OTO1 is unlimited site license. If you want more than 10, it includes cert commercial rights. It'll, put, it'll allow you to place live chat and Facebook comment box on your site. It'll allow you to use a Google Pixel and Facebook Pixel on your site to retarget visitors. And it's an unlimited reseller license as well. OTO number two allows you to put the pop-up on your site to collect your leads, and it gives you that 100 plus targeted travel content sources to your site that I showed you. You can also set up push notifications, and OTO three will instantly add the uh, content, the other, um, the other monetizable uh, aspect of it by placing the Amazon store. It allows you access to 12 million Amazon products. You can put luggage, you can put carry-on bags, you can put all kinds of traveling stuff on there. And OTO4 is one-on-one -on -one support. Um, it's a done-for-you type of thing where they will go in and do everything for you. For, uh, for, for you, they will go in and do everything for you. But like you said, like you seen, from my demo it's not hard so if you need everything is in there in the tutorials but if you need more help and you just need someone to walk you through how to do it watch this video again and once you pick it up go back and watch this video again and i go through it all um, marketing tools are included and oto5 is the agency package well you can create unlimited accounts for your clients and um, agency kits are included. So that is Site Travel Pro. If you have any questions about Site Travel Pro, hit me up down in the description I'll be, or in the comments. I'll be more than happy to answer any questions you may have before purchasing. And I hope this video had helped you to make a purchasing decision today. If it did, please click like below. If it not, click the down, uh, click down, thumbs down, to let me know that it did not help you and make sure you subscribe for more videos just like this. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.